Got some onion here. Got ourselves here. A little orange pepper. We got our green pepper. We got our mushrooms there. We got an all-purpose spice here. We're just gonna put some all-purpose spice on there. Come on now, get on out of there. There we go. Got a little bit of salt. Got a little bit of pepper. I don't need to show you what pepper looks like, right? Now, we also got here a little bouillon. We'll stick that right on top. Now, oh, come on now, I'm gonna use my finger. There you go, that's gonna stick. Okay, now, we're just gonna mix this together. You like what I'm using here? <laughs> I know I'm gonna get comments about that. All right, we'll see you in a second. All right, now you can see here that I added the ground beef already, and uh, everything in here is like all soft and ready to go. I'm just gonna set it aside to simmer, and you're gonna see what we're gonna do next. Got our pizza crust right here. Okay, and we're gonna take this, and we're gonna, we're just gonna roll it out. Take a look at that. Now we're also gonna spread it out. Take a look at this. Got ourselves some cheese. Ooh. Take a look at that there. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. We'll spread this That's around. Very spreadable. All the way to the edges. There you go. Look at that there. Nice. Mm. There you go. How does that look? That looks great. Pretty amazing. I think that's huh? a pretty good, good layer. Good layer there. Yeah. Okay. Now, we're going to bring this over. Okay. Mm. Now, ooh, that's hot. Ooh, okay. Now, we're going to spread this out. Now, I wonder, anybody know what we're making yet? I know my wife does, honey. Do. You cannot say. Okay. Okay. Now, we're putting this out there. Now, we may not want to use it all. We'll see here. Paul we're loves gonna... to play guessing games. <laughs> <laughs> we're going to spread this out here. Okay. Right. Mm. Now I know some of you don't like mushrooms. Look at me for a second. Come on up here. I know some of you probably already turned this off because you don't like mushrooms, okay? But I'm here to tell you, this this there's a city in the world that they've their foundation is mushrooms. Ooh. Okay? Now, let's see what we got here. Okay, we got some cheese here. We got some provolone cheese. Now you cannot have this particular item without provolone cheese. Okay. So let's stick it on there. All right, our final one goes on right there. Okay, now, here's what we gotta do. Okay, we gotta lift this side up right here. We gotta start to really take these edges and, and put them on right there, okay? Keep them nice and tight, okay? Now, using your parchment paper here, we're gonna bring it up like this, okay? Make sure you can get that down there just like that, okay? now. Bring up your parchment paper again. And we fold here. Mm, that's really helpful. It's very helpful. Okay. Take a look at that there. Okay. Parchment mm. paper again. Nice job, honey. Thank you so much. Look at that there. Now we're gonna run out of parchment paper down here at oh, the end. That's okay. So it's okay. We're going. We're going to bring it down here. Yeah. We're gonna pull it back just a second. Okay. Okay. Now here's what we got going on here. Here we go. We're going to fold it again. Perfect. Look at that there, huh? Yeah. Now that looks good, huh? Sure does. Now here's the thing. You see this? Mm -hmm. It's empty, but not for long. Okay, come right yeah. here. We're going to do some cutting. Here we go. Ooh. Ooh, there we go. We got this. We can do this. There we go. Okay. With that there. Okay. And we got one right here. Now here's the thing. I don't know if they're all going to fit in there. Mm -hmm. I might have made them not thick enough. Oh, okay. But here we go. See? Take a look here. Okay. 
And we got our pinwheels here, right? Mm -hmm. We'll look stick them just like that there. That's okay. Great. Does that not look good? It does. Look okay. okay, bring this out here. There we go, just like that there. One more. Here's the very end. That's perfect, and those are gonna expand. Yeah, they're too. gonna expand, and we're gonna stick this in the oven, and we're gonna see you soon. Now, some of you probably saw that I got some extra here, but that's for somebody special. Mr. Hobbs, my sous chef. Well, now he might want to try some of this. Would you Would you like to try some of this? Oh, well, there you go. Would you like some more while we're waiting on, on our, our Philadelphia cheese steaks to bake? Would you like some more? I'll just give you a... You good? Okay. I'll see you later. Oh my goodness, take a look at this here. Now, does that not look incredible? Unfortunately, it looks like it's all kind of gone together, but I'm gonna see if I can get one out of here. Uh, I think I'm just gonna try my closest one. What's that? Yeah, I think you can do it. I think I can do it. Maybe I need a knife here. Maybe I'll just go in here with, with my uh, spatula here. I let these cool for about 20 minutes. Now, they, oh, whoa. Look at that. Whoa, that wow. Came out beautifully. Look at that there, huh? They do come out well. Mm -hmm. That is wow. just beautiful, isn't it? Looks great. I'm all proud of it. Come on up here for a second. I gotta be honest, this is the first time I made this, and I'm all, I'm, I'm proud of myself. <laughs> you should be. That looks good, that looks great. All right, okay, so now, just so you know, we put this in for about 25 minutes at 400 degrees, okay? And then we mm -hmm. let it sit for about 20 minutes. Now, I'm gonna take a bite here. Okay, you keep going back and forth there, baby. <laughs> mm. Got the steam in there. I got the cheese. The provolone and the and the cheddar. Look, now, that looks amazing, you guys. This is delicious.